I'll show you how you can turn your smartphone into a speaker wirelessly or with a USB for better connection. Hello and welcome to Budget Zero. Today, I would like to first introduce a new series where I turn my smartphone into various computer components such as how I use my smartphone as a webcam, a keyboard, mouse, and today, a speaker. If you are interested in any of those, I'll link my place up in the cards or down link in the description below. So let's get right into it. Some of the reasons you might want to turn your smartphone into a wireless speaker is might be your computer speaker is broken or you want to cast some music or podcast into a speaker while you do something at home. It is really simple on how you can turn your smartphone into a speaker for your laptop or computer. Go to your Play Store and download an app called Audio Relay. And oh, by the way, it is only for Android and Windows laptop. So just install this and I already installed so I will open it. Right now, go to your laptop and go to audiorelay.net and download it for Windows. After you install and allow all the permissions, go and search for the app Audio Relay. Open it. So what you're going to do first is go and choose the device and make sure it's the default speaker. Make sure to check by pressing here and turn it to your default speaker. Right now, it is my default speaker. Right now, make sure you're in the same Wi-Fi connection and your app will automatically display your laptop. So just click on it and it will automatically pair to your phone. So now it is done and can be transmitted through wirelessly. Right now, let's test my wireless speaker. So I would like to just turn off my speaker here or not. Both of them will play at the same time. It will be a, quite annoying. So turn on your sound and then play some sound. As you can see, it is right now playing. For the latency, I think it's pretty good for a wireless connection. It doesn't really lag a lot in my experience. Connecting through Bluetooth is also really easy. So right now, let me just turn off my Wi-Fi and then get a USB cable. So if something like this pops up, just click on transfer files and then go to settings and enable USB tethering. Click back and you will see a new IP address will pop up. So just click on this, go back to your client. You don't need to do anything with your client app, just minimize it and then just click play on any videos. As you can see, it is right now already connected. The connection is really much better for the USB. As you can hear right now. Thank you for watching this video. If you find any value, please consider like and subscribe. And if you want to check out some of the playlists, it will be linked down in the description below. And if you have any problems or questions, feel free to comment down below or DM me on Instagram at BudgetZero. Finally, stay safe, stay home, and see you guys again. BudgetZero, out!